and we're back guys tennis in a minute i'm your host get energy i'm in the studio and we are taking a look at my top 10 players to watch out for in the upcoming season now this is a list consisting of teenagers who primarily play most of their matches on the lower level but this upcoming season could be the big year where they break out and go deep in a slam you never know number eight is solana sierra She's from Argentina. She is 19 years old and she has a win percentage of nearly 70%. She's got six ITF championships. And listen, guys, she's even got a doubles championship. Solana was a top 10 ranked junior, number seven to be exact. And in 2021, she made the US Open semifinal and she went three sets with Coco Golf's bestie, Robin Montgomery. Robin would beat Solana and eventually win the US Open girls title, but next year, ladies and gentlemen, she would have a very impressive run at the French Open. She made the doubles quarterfinal, and in singles, she made the championship match. She would lose to Lucy Halikova, but a very impressive run, showing her skills on clay. She plays right-handed and her favorite shots her two-handed backhand. Already at the young age of 19, she's made 10 ITF championship matches and she has a 60% win rate. She won 35 matches last year and she's already surpassed that by 22. Wow. She's got 57 wins on the year and one more tournament, she might even hit 60. 54 of those wins have come on clay. Even though clay is a slower surface, her ability to get to her backhand on clay shows her baselining skills and ability to close out. She also has variety as she mixes in the drop shot occasionally. She loves to use a high bounce to get her opponents playing defensive until she patiently steps up and finds the right shot. Already, even at the young age of 19, she's already defeated some of the best clay players on the circuit. Laura Pagasi, she's beat. Sarah Irani, Marcella Zachare, and Emma Navarro unbelievable she also went three sets recently with diane perry in a thriller the reason i think solana could have a breakout year in 24 is because this season she played in three wta tournaments and she made the quarterfinals in two of them of the 26 overall tournaments she played in she was guaranteed to make at least the quarterfinals in 60 percent of them that's a pretty good darn ratio while making the championship matches in 30 percent of them Pretty impressive, right? Exactly. Of course, the big win was Emma Navarro in Brazil, but she even got revenge on Robin Montgomery, who won the 21 US Open Juniors Championship in Argentina in front of the home crowd, and she beat Robin in straight sets. That's a picture of Solana going to the backhand. That's an older picture as she's put on strength now. But I wanna show you something. Take a look at this algorithm. In today's day and age, it's all about algorithms. Look at that upward trend. Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't think she's gonna have a huge 2024, you got another thing coming. Solana Sierra, ladies and gentlemen, from Argentina, number eight on my list of prospects to watch out for in 2024. In particular, clay season. I think she's gonna have an amazing run that could see her get inside of the top 100 for the first time ever tennis in a minute show some love for this amazing tennis player out of argentina solana sierra and we'll be right back stay tuned for number seven 